Living life to a healthy, ripe old age, isn't that what we all want? The owner of this olive grove is 107. He's managed to escape cancer, Alzheimer's, and all the other illnesses we fear as we age. For decades, scientists have been trying to decode the aging process to stave off diseases that can all too often blight old age. On occasion, their research can lead them far off the beaten track. One valley in Ecuador is home to a multitude of tracks that are barely marked on maps. There, in remote villages, certain people would appear to be protected from diabetes, cancer, and perhaps even Alzheimer's. But these men and women, who may seem to have been blessed by the gods, have for a long time considered themselves abandoned by God. Because of one characteristic, their very short stature. They've lived a life of isolation, out of the public eye, far from imagining that their blood may contain a secret that could one day benefit the whole of humanity. When the Spaniards came here, they were hoping to find gold, El Dorado. I've been lucky enough to find something even better than gold. I've been lucky enough to find what I call the El Dorado of genetics and endocrinology. These patients are so special. They're much more valuable than any metal. Small size, big mystery. What is it in their biological makeup that protects them? And could an understanding of these mechanisms one day protect the rest of the world?